7-Eleven. You just ran the semi-finals in the 100 meter hurdles, the second place, so you're qualified for the final. Uh, yeah, exactly. I mean, I hit a few hurdles. That's part and parcel of a hurdles race. Um, delighted I'm into the final. That's what I said to my coach before, and I don't care where I come, just as long as there's a big cube beside my name. And um, that's what I got. Really looking forward to resting there tonight and coming out tomorrow evening. This, this morning you also had the, the heats and then the, the, that you won it in 13.38, so close to your PB. Uh, what kind of race was it in the morning? Um, I felt quite um, weak this morning. You know, I didn't have my strength. Um, I didn't get much sleep last night, so um, that didn't help. But um, I was good, I mean, to run that close to my PB, not feel like I was... Um, not feel like I was completely giving it everything. Um, I was just unfortunate in that race to hit a few hurdles, but I'm glad it not happened now rather than in the final. You didn't get much sleep tonight, this night, was it because you were nervous? Yes, I think it was a bit of everything, you know, it was just, I'm a great sleeper, normally I could sleep for 14 hours, but um, yeah, no, that's just something you've got to deal with. And I'm glad tomorrow night it's on in the evening because I like my sleep ins. <laughs> So um, that'll be, that's exciting. Is it your first big major championship? Um, no, last year I was at the World Juniors. Unfortunately, I fell on in the semi-final and I was definitely on to run a big time, maybe even make the final. So that was really disappointing. But I said, like, I've been working for this European Junior since last year, falling at the World, at the world Juniors. So, um, yeah, I mean, before that I medaled at the EYOF, you know, the European Youth Olympics. So, um, it's definitely not my first, but the experience is good to have. And um, I'm hoping that the final will go to plan. You made it to the final now again. What kind of expectations do you have? I mean, everyone wants to win it. No one lines up on that line and doesn't want to win it. I think every girl is capable of doing it. And it's all who wants it more. And, you know, hurdles are so risky. Anything can happen to anyone. So I'm, um, it really is up for anyone to take, anyone to get on the podium. So um, it's just wait and see. Well, the, the racing the hurdles is also getting more experience. What, uh, what, in what part or what thing are you more experienced in than last year? I think I'm definitely more experienced in just how to handle uh, like something that doesn't go well because, like there, my I was maybe about fifth at hurdle eight, and you know I was like just get your act together and get yourself get yourself up there. So um. I mean, you just need to deal with, you learn to deal with adversity a bit more and a bit easier. So it's definitely been a great building block for the future. Thank you very much and good luck. Thank you very much.